Today I'm going to show you guys a bait that we use up here in Zuland for the giant guitar fish. In actual fact, this one is not designed for big sandies. Early season, we often get these 10 to 20 to 30 kilo sandies in the area, and then they don't want the huge mackerel bait. They're a bit fussy and they prefer a little red eye bait. Um, over the years, we've developed this little red eye bait that I'm going to show you that works for early season sandies, especially when the young ones are around and they don't look for that big meaty bait. Alright, so all it's going to be, it's going to be a nice little red eye bait that we attach to a dingle. Distance is key, we're throwing onto deeper banks that's quite far out, so you want to put your dingle on and get a long cast. So as always, nice and fresh red eye. As I was say, when you're up in Zuland in Natal, don't come here with old bait, you're not going to succeed. The fish are fussy, they want fresh bait. Okay, so what we're going to do, we're going to cut our red eye so that we've got all the flavors from the gill plates and the guts that's in this bait. So you take your knife and we do a cross section through the gill plates past the guts, the belly section like that. Right, as you can see, we've got all those flavors there that's exposed which you lay out your bait. And now what I'm going to do, the remaining of the bait, I'm going to take our knife and just do cutlets. So basically cut the whole red eye up. Cutlets that are half a centimeter thick, even a bit thinner. So we're going to use a whole lot for this bait. Right, so now we're going to start putting the bait together. Grab our bait needle through the mouth of the red eye down the spine. Clip our dingle on, pull it through. A dingle in the mouth, and we're going to attach a hook. Do the dingle quickly. Through the dingle, through the mouth, the red eye. Right, so we've got the half cut in and we're going to cotton that on now. Right, so we've got the head on, and all we need to do is start packing those cutlets around it now. Try and keep that shape. Right, and then that final little piece. Cutting it on.
and that's our little sandy redeye bait done as you can see it's got a lot of flavor it's nicely shaped so it can travel through the air and you can get the distance you require all right so we're up here in Zuland with Gerard Geese he's a friend of mine and a pro angler with pure fishing and pen as well and he's come up all the way here to look for a sand shark it's not a species they get down in the Eastern Cape so every summer he comes up and he spends a week or two with me targeting them and we've found this nice place up in the north coast it's a beautiful bank and it's a very long cast and I'm sure Gerard will reach a bank and with this bait if he reaches a bank I'm quite sure he's gonna get that bite we're looking for First row in the afternoon session. Uh, Rudolf picked us a nice spot here, nice rolling bank. Uh, just a bit of an all round bait. A red eye on a nylon trace, and uh, seems like I've got a video on you. Rudolf reckons it's a sand shark, we'll see. He's usually wrong. Nice little male sandy. It was a good go here on the reef, it was surprisingly strong. Uh, it was the first throw, so things are looking up for this evening session. I'm quite stoked. 